How to share my code on GitHub. Well, that's what I'm going to show you guys in a super quick and easy tutorial. So if this video helped you out, please let me know in the comments and let's get started right away. So you want to go ahead and go to github.com and create an account. Um, once you've done that, you want to go to this plus icon, which is called create new. Now you want to click on new repository. Now a repository is pretty much just your like mini website where uh, people can find your code if you have it on public. So you want to give this pretty much a name um, of your project, pretty much. So I'll just go ahead and call this test for YouTube. And it says uh, it gives you a little bit, a little check if it's all right, your name. And then here you can add a description. So I'll just do something like this is a test, but obviously you need, need to add a description of uh, you know what your project is about then we have the public or private so here it says anyone on the internet can see this repository you choose who can commit and private is you choose who can see and commit to this repository so that's up to you if you want to have this on public or private i'm going to leave it on public for now now here we can add a readme file now if you don't know what this is this is pretty much uh, a readme file where you can uh, explain what your product project is all about in more detail so the description is just something short but the readme file is just uh, very detailed uh, so you can add that if you want to and here we can also add a dot git ignore and what this is is that um, you can choose to ignore specific file types so for example you can choose to ignore java for example but you can pretty much uh, ignore all of these as you can see so that is up to you if you would like that or not. I'm just, for the sake of this tutorial, going to add that just like that. So here we can choose a license. Now, if you want to create something big and for others to use as well, and this is actually like pretty important because this decides if what people can do with your code, for example. So it says a license tells you tells others what they can, can and can do with your code. So here you can learn more about licensing um, and what they are all about so if you're interested in that then uh, read uh, because you if you like i said if you want to create something big then you should definitely have some sort of license or else people can for example completely steal your code or uh, whatever so i'm going to cl click on create repository and now we have our repository so we have two files the git ignore and the readme so if you click on there, um, you can see how it looks like. And then for the readme as well. So here on the right, we can actually edit this file. So we can uh, add more to the readme file, for example. Now, if you want to upload your code, and what you can do is here, click on add file. You can create a new file to, for example, start your code, but you can also upload a file of your code. So if you click on there, this will open up and you have to choose your code file. So you can, this will, you know, what you've downloaded on your PC. Then uh, here you have to simply commit the changes and then this will be added over here. Now, if you decide to start your code inside of GitHub, you can also click on create a new file, um, give it a name and then start it right over here, right? So that is pretty much it. That's how to share my code on GitHub.